Try to remain calm. <laughs> There's a national emergency, haven't you heard? We... Uh, but I really appreciate you being here. So the, uh, the order is signed, and uh, I'll sign the final papers as soon as I get into the Oval Office. And we will have a national emergency, and we will then be sued, and they will sue us in the Ninth Circuit, uh, even though it shouldn't be there. And we will possibly get a bad ruling, and then we'll get another bad ruling, and then we'll end up in the Supreme Court, and hopefully we'll get a fair shake, and we'll win in the Supreme Court, just like the ban. They sued us in the Ninth Circuit, and we lost, and then we lost in the appellate division, and then we went to the Supreme Court, and we won. You know, yet another great reason for Trump to not be president is that I now kind of want to see him as a historical expert on the next Ken Burns miniseries. They killed the Archduke, and Germany got mad, and then there were tanks, and also poison. Yes, the, he did it. <laughs> Fucko did it today. <laughs> He declared a national emergency. He was in the Rose Garden in the morning. You could tell this is when he normally has executive time because he was still in curlers. <laughs> <laughs> and he, this was just completely crackers. I know I've said that before, but this was just one long, baseless, incoherent stream of consciousness called the nursing home. <laughs> Rant. I mean, we don't, it's, you know, we don't even notice anymore when he gets stupider. <laughs> it's like farting on a garbage ship. Who notices? <laughs> um, <laughs> you know who should have declared a national emergency long ago? Fact checkers. That's. <laughs> Please, <clears throat> there's, there's no reality anymore. I mean, reporters were asking him questions. At one point, he said to a reporter who gave him statistics from his own administration, and he said, you really believe stats? <laughs> yes, I do. I mean, there is nothing really left to say about this, except a national emergency should not be used by Trump. It should be used on Trump. <laughs> Just to refresh your memory why we're in this little bit of a pickle, we had a government shutdown, remember that? Over the wall. And now we're having a national emergency declared over a wall because the master negotiator was offered $25 billion for his wall some time ago. Turn that down. In December, he was offered $1.6 billion. Turn that down. Now they signed a deal for $1.3 billion. Today, Mexico said, fuck, if it gets any lower, maybe we will pay for it. 